Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to uh, League of Legends lore reaction. Now here's the thing, I, I really wanted to make this reaction because I saw a uh, Aurelian Soul trailer pop up, drop on uh, the League of Legends channel, the official one obviously. So I'm really excited to check this out because you guys know Aurelian Soul and Shen are one of my favorite champions in League of Legends because those are the two I only play. I also play Jin a lot as ADC. I don't prefer to play ADC that much because ADC is kind of boring and I suck at doing CS and all this shit. So, uh, I'm, so I'm really excited for the Aurelian Soul rework. I haven't got to try it. I did try it at least one time in the PVE, but it was quite garbage because the thing is, you got constant gank because nobody liked you because if you picked Aurelian Soul, that's just how it is. Either way, uh, as usual, I will link the original video in the description so you guys can check out and all this stuff. We will also actually react to the first Aurelian Soul trailer after we finish the new one, which was released today. Woo! Let's go, boys. Really excited, boys. Before me, existence was empty. If only. Barren. By my will, I filled it with wonder. That's such a badass visual. Mortals special. strive to construct their own adorably inadequate marvels. Yeah, he's too arrogant true as usual. Power is only found in the cosmos. Okay. I'm sorry to pause this, but this would be so cool as a desktop wallpaper. Holy fuck. If it was like animation as well, animation wise, hopefully somebody makes that because I really would want to have this in my desktop. Not that I would do it actually because my PC is not that good. It is what it is. I feel the rework already. Fuck it, Slavic. You thought you could wield it. Because you could take me. Get out of here, Zoe. Nobody likes you. Oh, that's right, you can't. With every crack your hole weakens. Every fracture brings a galaxy of strength. And while I long to return to my stars, first I shall be unleashed. He is unleashed. Holy fuck, it's loud. I'm sorry if it's too loud, but it's badass. Targon? Losing your grip. Fuck Targon, man. Nobody likes Targon. They fucking trick my boy Aurelian Soul. It's kind of fucking stupid when you think about it logically. How the fuck does a god dragon get still, well, enslaved by a mere crown? Which I can really assume is that Celestia will probably involve something like a Sorak or a Bard and all of these. I'm not sure how many Celestials there are, but I'm pretty sure they were involved in making the crown. There's no way humans could have made a crown that could enslave a dragon god. Um, this is this is also actually very cool for a wallpaper. I would definitely love an animation like this for the wallpaper. Holy fuck, this trailer has so many good points for a wallpaper you can have on your computer. I will love it. Please drop it on Steam. Thank you very much. It's released today if I'm right. I'm gonna fucking play the shit out of it. I love this. Laugh. All right, I think that's it. This is also a cool wallpaper scene. Okay, so that was very cool, and as I promised, we will check out the first one, Aurelian Soul: The Star Forger Returns, because I haven't actually, even though I should have reacted to this first, because this is the older one before he got reworked and all this stuff. But you know what? It is. It doesn't really matter. It's not like there's some sort of. Uh, chronological order behind this trailer, so it's fine. Let's react to this, boys. Really excited. A Soul, the Star Forger. I'll admit I've seen this before, many years ago, at least back when it was... When the fuck did this come out? No Six years ago. That's a long time ago. I love Arena no Soul trailers, like the stars and the galaxy. space. It's so beautiful. So beautiful. They always look up in wonder. Yeah, because they're peasants and mortals. What do you expect? Some fall to their knees and worship. Rip our alien soul stars now. Others hide behind walls and towers. This is so badass. Look at this. Woo! Hey, I don't want to fuck with Aesol, nobody wants him. 
That is fucking just adorable. adorable. I'm sorry if I'm talking during the mid during mid uh, cutscene and all this or trailer because I just like to give my ideas or opinions on the trailer itself while the trailer is ongoing because I really don't want to. I'm trying to skip less between videos or be in each video because I don't want the reactions to be like fucking ten minutes an hour long or something like that. Either way, this was very short. Obviously, like it was like one minute the uh, trailer, one minute video. Sadly, so together it'll be like two minutes or something. But I feel like it was very nice. Everybody was really excited for Aurelian Soul uh, rework and the new trailer probably that popped up right now. Because Aurelian Soul has always been a very underrated champion. Nobody fucking played that. I'm pretty sure people played Skarner and Ivan more than Aurelian Soul, if I'm honest. I don't remember. But the reason, main reason was because Aurelian Soul was also one of the only champions in the entire game that could not hide in bushes. So, map, uh, map hiding was pretty much useless as an Aurelian Soul player. But if I'm honest, there were some, I guess, uniqueness to Aurelian Soul, at least the olden one, where the star and all this shit. It was just, it just unique, it was fun. It was honestly very fun to play around with. But I will admit, I still prefer the reworked version now, even though the old one was very unique and fun in its own way. But I still prefer the new one because it was, gameplay-wise, it was pretty garbage. You lost a lot of times fast. If you like, faced against an assassin, you would lose easily, especially like a Zed or Talon. Because even if you have your ult to wipe them out or try and get them away from you, they will still could. They still got a lot of more options for gap closing. It's like it's, it doesn't matter. It's not gonna help you that much. So yeah, I'm really happy with the new Aurelian Soul rework. Obviously, they are it's still gonna be weak to assassins, I would assume. And I've heard that Victor is one of the most annoying matchups against the the new ASO rework, especially in mid lane. But I will see how it goes. It might actually even get nerfed because it's very, very OP. Because you can literally solo dragons, at least late game, um, very fast, honestly. And he has that E ability, which is his black hole. He can actually fucking CC dragons, which should be immune to all kinds of CC and crowd control. But Aurelian Souls uh, E black hole can literally stop his movement. Ridiculous. Either way, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I hope to see you again next time. Bye-bye.